Hello and welcome to Microwave Me, the show where I microwave shit so you don't have to. Today, I'm going to be microwaving this fluorescent tube light. But you're probably thinking, but Captain Microwave, you microwaved a fluorescent light a year and a half ago and it was a disaster. Uh, but that was a CFL. It had a ballast, and when the ballast burned, it sent all that mercury crap into the air. This, no ballast, should be no problem. And the only microwave big enough to do this is Big Jurath, the Kenmore beast of a microwave. Okay, let's open them up. Stick it in. The light bulb and let's get microwaving okay four minutes should be enough all right now let's get microwaving
Well, that was really cool and surprisingly safe looking, and it looks like nothing happened to the bulb either. It just looked like a giant ghostly lightsaber of some sort. As if you noticed, uh, not only is it a fluorescent light, but a black light too. I already did a regular black light over a year ago, and while well, that was cool, I honestly think this was a lot better. Okay, let's remove the post product and examine it a little better. Wow! Looks to me like the whole bulb is intact. Nothing bad happened to it. There's no holes in it, no burning. You could probably still use this puppy if you wanted to for some reason. There's no smell, there was no smoke, no damage to the bulb. Uh, it just glowed that brilliant purple for that whole time and a little bit of that famous greenish light from fluorescence got mixed in as you know you remember the CFL but wow this is the opposite of the CFL I'm gonna actually go out on a limb and say this is safe because nothing at all bad happened with this